Hey, today a good day. See, I got the helmet in hand, but we're not hopping on no bike. She about to buy a bike. Coming in. This is a great vlogable moment. We get to vlog the whole day for you guys. Now we, what? The Starbucks life. I can't, I just can't wait to get on this bike for real. I just want to get on the bike. Yes, I will be careful on your bike. Guys, what should I be getting from Starbucks? Because man is betraying me, and I don't know what I want. For real. Let me start with you. I can't wait for Alexia to get a bike, guys. Oh, I'm so hyped. Huh? Compensation was real for that. Um, we about to go to Sunrise Cycles in Norfolk to go pick up a bike. The bike's not supposed to be done till tonight, though. Well, not tonight, later today. But I don't feel like it should take that long to put a battery in a bike and stay to inspect it. So we're going to see what happens when we get there. Um, but you know, Starbucks runs my day, so I just needed it to get my life started. Oh, that's a nice Halloween set. You know, yeah, I really like just be talking like. I realize I'm a good people person because I just be, I just be like, I fit in with everybody. I can be one of the girls. What do you mean by that? I can be one of the guys. I'm one of the homies. Like, I'm just everywhere. Thank you. Make sure y'all drink y'all Starbucks with a straw. I just want to say, because they be putting their hands on a lid. And we still be putting our mouths on it like people get together. We don't wash our hands. We don't wash our hands. So it's pretty, it's pretty sunny desk outside. Sunny desk. Get out the road, y'all. So What's okay, Terry doing, y'all? Bag up, bag up, bag up, Terry. Put it in reverse, Terry. Put it in reverse. Oh, Lord, Lord, Terry. Move his. Oh, shit. I always be forgetting when you get out of a truck, it got a step if it's too big, because um, I definitely just didn't care right there. <laughs> so I ain't gonna take my book bag in, because. Ain't none in my book bag. We just gonna take the camera, but yeah, we're here and it's time to get it in. Let's see how excited Lexi is. Look at the smile. Ooh, look at the R1. I just wanna go look at the R1 real quick. Look, oh shit, Terry ain't got no legs, Lexi. I wanna look at the R1. Uh, to be honest, dealerships be on. Dealerships be on real bullshit, but we just gonna go through with it because the bullshit is real. How you doing, boss? You want me to talk to something? I'm Tyler. You're Alexia? Yeah. Tyler, nice to meet you. How you guys doing? Tyler, bye, bye. How you doing, boss? Kobe. What's your name? Kobe. Kobe. Tyler, nice to meet you. You wanna go check this one out? Hey. So I have a 600. I kind of want a 636. Um, should I get a 636 or 750? Because I don't know which one I want. But also, it's like, I don't know. Because my man's just trying to make sales and shit. So, you know what I'm saying? But Alexia's here looking at a Ninja 500. A Ninja 500 for her. I feel like it's a perfect bike for her. She rode my MT-07 and the seat height is too high for her and it has too much torque in low end power instead of more in a higher end. So that's another reason she didn't really like my bike. So she doesn't need a bike that big and she's not going to be going fast. I don't see why not. Sit on that thing. Much better than riding my bike. Yeah, yeah see. So she rode my bike. In the part in a parking lot, we didn't go take it out of first gear or anything like that. Just teach her clutch control and a couple other things. But this one definitely sits a lot better. I could tell it sits a lot better for her. 
But the red special edition definitely does look so much better. This shit is so light. Oh my gosh. I'm gonna have a fucking blast. Oh my gosh, I'm gonna have a blast. Yo. Yeah, they turn. And then here's the red one. The red one's sold, but they have another one that's in the back, I guess. I think I think the whole no key shit is amazing on a bike. Like, not having a key is the best part. And this is a special edition. Yeah, these black and red ones and the 40th anniversaries are the ones that Kawasaki put that package on. Mm -hmm. People start the frame sliders, all that stuff, so. Right. Should I make bad decisions? I should make bad decisions. I'm a big bad influence, so. <laughs> I'm about to buy a new bike today, guys. So look at her loving this. You gotta get her the red one. Does look better on the red one? Yeah, sure. <laughs> Just spending more money. Bad influence. I'm trying not to sit on a bike because. I make impulsive decisions. <laughs> He's like, yeah, I'm getting this here today. He sits on a bike. Yep. <laughs> I'm going to say load it up, man. I do want a new bike so bad, though. What do you got? Uh, MT-07. Don't talk to me. MT-07. Yeah, that was my first bike, so I feel like I'm just ready. I just want to get out of it. I kind of want a sport bike because I want to. Well, coming out the R9 next year. So oh, wow. Might have, to, might have to wait a year. That would be dope to have. You just gotta think what color you want. Which color you like? <laughs> she likes the red one. Yeah, I feel like she, bro, you just gonna get the red one regardless. Like, oh, oh, can you hold this? Oh fuck, I didn't think they would have this bike. Dixer 750. Guys. I ain't gonna lie, I've been looking at Jixxer 750 just because it's faster than 636 in top end, and it just has more power than a 636 or a 600 or Jixxer 600. But, oh my goodness, my, my life would be amazing with this bike. Oh my God, oh God. I would literally kill myself for this bike. And it's so nice, the color is just, Fuck that safety off right now. I, I ride around in a t-shirt. Exactly. I'm finna ride back just like this. All right, so we're in a, the gear section. We're just gonna look at some gear. Let's look at the fit today, though. Oh, look at these little dope little helmets. That's cool. Get a couple of those. They got Spirit HD. They got the cheap cardos over here and the cheap riding stuff. They got oil. They got me. Tight shit. It's a kudo, if y'all with it. A burnica, a burnica plat, a burnica pancake platter. It's a crudo. A jacket. Oh. Bro, I got set up. I got set up. I got set up. Bro, I got, I got set up, guys. I got set up. So, I'm gonna put this back. Just got a little set up. So, someone ain't zipped this jacket and they put it back, but don't worry. Get in there, Z. I ain't foul. I'm not foul. She get Alpine Star everything. Alpine Star from the head to the toe. She should have just bought the Alpine Star helmet. Now what you do with that? Punch him in the face and say, give me your fucking bike. <laughs> give me your fucking bike. Bow. No, ma'am. She's just trying on gloves. They don't have... 3XL is outrageous. 
Hey, how? I'm glad my hands are. I'm not fitting that. I don't know. After a while, two X kind of becomes too big for me. I mean, after that's broken in. One guy was in here yesterday. He was six seven. Holy shit! Big boy. And he tried on the four X gloves. It was still snug to him. Oh wow! And he said, "Maybe I cut that fingertip." <laughs> <laughs> you gotta do what you gotta do to fit it. Yeah. yeah. I don't ever. I don't wear glasses when I'm riding under my visor with the dark visor. But tell me, tell me, tell me this ain't. Tell me I'm not. Tell me I'm not rocking. <laughs> lit, we lit. Nah, that's dope with the pads though. But me, me personally, I don't know. These kind of make me look like a superhero. I'm finna get me. I better get these. I don't know. I might buy some glasses now. But I don't need dark ones, bro. Like, there's no need for me to get dark glasses. I have a dark visor. Oh, these are what the these are foggy in this bitch. Oh, fuck. Hey, that's enough playing around. I'm gonna let you. She is she is rocking the whole black and red vibe. Like black and red to the socks. Black black and red to the socks. I'm telling you black and red to the socks, you cannot beat it. You do not look like a man. You're welcome. Guys, yesterday, she told me, she was like, will you tell me if I look like a man in the gear? And I said, of course. Of course. I like you, man. You lie a lot. Who, me? Yes, you. I'm a, I got some screws loose in my head. We got a couple screws loose. It's okay, though. <laughs> <laughs> I'm really like I really she's really buying a bike right now. It's been I want to say it's been maybe three weeks since I gave her a ride on the back of my bike. Uh, we were at work one night and I was like, we're bored. So you want to <coughs> hop on a bike? She hopped on a bike. Now three weeks later we're in the bike store buying a bike. It's crazy. It is actually crazy. Look at these guys. Look at these guys. They're having a blast. They're having a blast. Like it. Yeah, it fits your your colorway, <laughs> and it matches your car. You're welcome. Just want my coffee up the car, because you know, spent this time doing this shit for Alexia, because you were just such <laughs> an awesome guy that um, I'm willing to do these things for my friends. You feel me? Whether or not my friends would do shit like this for me. Hey, we'll see when the time comes. There's a beautiful ass red and black R1M. Well, not M. R1 sitting over there. Would I buy it? Fuck yes. Would, uh, is it a bad decision? Fuck yes. Do I make stupid decisions all the time? Fuck yes. But that's part of life. That's part of life, guys. And really, I'm glad that I'm starting this content ground again. Because... I don't care what people think. I'm not making content for the money to get up on YouTube. I'm making content because I really fucking enjoy life and the things I do in life. Like, and everyone can have it. It doesn't have to be going to fucking Mexico, traveling to Dubai, shit like that. You don't have to be rich. Like, we do fun shit on a daily basis. Like, having a bike is some fun shit. So it's just like, why not do it? Things change people change you know but i'm still here to show y'all life is about just having fun you know when you just have fun everything goes your way um i don't really stress life too much i live in the moment so this is something cool like i'm i'm glad i get to share the experience like she saw how happy i was riding my bike and doing things on my bike that I get to share the experience with her now. And she's gonna enjoy the same things, even though she might be scared at the beginning, but who knows? So we'll see where it goes and we'll see what happens. 
but let's go back inside. But her bike is done and we are back. So let's go take a look. This is. Ninja 500. No key is crazy. This one's going to be a black and red one. They ain't gonna put no one. Be crazy if you didn't get to keep the other seat. You pick your option here. Nah, guys, this is great. And you don't have to buy the little tank things. So, this is. Yeah, I knew that. That's what remember I was telling you the other day? is a nice bike. He about to go over it with her just so she knows everything on the bike. Let me see. Where did so, you I think it's cool how Kawasaki comes with that. The option of not having a rear seat. So if you ever want to take this off, you put the key in down here and turn it to the right and then it'll unlock this and you can just take it off. Okay. For this one, so that's out of the non cover. And that's the cover. And guys, this is his Ninja 500. So his isn't the special edition, but it's the ABS version. But he also has a Leo Vinci on it. So I like the, the way his bike sounds. As far as starting the bike, whenever you have the key near you, you're able to start it. You just push this in. It'll light this this little light up, and then you turn it to the right. I'll turn on the display. The uh, y'all hear the stock exhaust? You can see the trip indication. I'm so excited. And then this one will change like the average, the range on the gas tank. All that kind of stuff. I'll just put it on range for now. Just to make sure you see that. Um, I pay attention to the temperature gauge. You can at least want it to be. Yeah, it should have a full tank of gas in it. Yeah. So, so that's how you see it. It's going to go all the way down. Um, because it, it hasn't moved like, yet. started moving yet. And also it's it's tilted over to the side, so... Probably doesn't think the bike's up. Yeah, when the bike is tilted over, it'll show a lower fuel level than what it actually has. So sometimes when you start it, it'll show you when you have three bars of fuel, and then as you get going down the road, it'll go back up two bars. And the special edition also came with frame sliders, so that's a good thing. Not having to pay for frame sliders is also fucking great. I love the way the new ninjas look with this new front end. Full LED headlights. Headlights. So this is a good beginner bike if you are looking for beginner bikes. Guys, Alexia looks like a real ass rider right now. I can't even count. Look at her. You remember how, right? Bro. All right. First, set the handlebars up. Clutch in. Kick stand, kick stand up first. Clutch in. First gear down. Yeah, they're different. They're angled more towards a sports bike. Now 
Now slowly let out the clip. This way, this way. Yeah. Yeah. We're out here breeding future riders, brother. Future riders are getting bred. Where's she going? I have no clue. Hey, by the way, so you guys know, Alexia does take her class on Saturday. That's why we got the bike now. So that way, after she takes the class, she's able to just hop on the bike and ride. She doesn't have to go through this whole process once she gets her license. It's a lot, I feel like it's a lot easier to do it this way. So this is the way we did it. Let the clutch out slow. Yeah, let the bike move for you. There you go. Yeah. Alright guys, so that's Alexia riding it. I'ma hop back when we get on the bike, so peace.